31 is triple light noisy motion strober. I replaced the speaker with the motor and then put the speaker between these two points, between the four snap wire and the red LED. All three LEDs are still here and I am going to turn on the slide switch. The two LED, the color and red LEDs blink, the white LED doesn't because there's not enough power for it to run. If I had stronger batteries or an AC adapter, it might work. The speaker makes noise, but the fan motor also spins slowly. Don't put any fan on the motor because that's what the instructions say. Plus the speaker I think would get in the way anyway. I'm going to move the RV. Now the setting is slower and the fan motor barely spins. Now at the highest setting, none of the LEDs are on, but the speaker is at full volume and the motor is spinning more rapidly, close to full speed at least. Project 32 is automatic light. I am going to put my hand over the phototransistor and the white LED comes on. When I move my hand away from the phototransistor, the white LED goes off. Move my hand back over and it comes back on. This circuit works the same way as many outdoor lights, which have special sensors that turn the light on in dark conditions, like street lamps or parking lot lamps. That way, when they are not needed, they will turn off automatically and save energy. The phototransistor is what is either increasing or decreasing electrical resistance. In this case, it's increasing electrical resistance when there is outside light, and that's why the white LED turns off. When I cover the phototransistor, the resistance decreases, and the white LED will come on. You can use the RV lever here to adjust the sensitivity of the phototransistor. Now you need more light to turn the white LED off. But on the lowest setting here, you need more darkness. You don't need as much light to turn it off. Project 33 is called Color Oscillator. For this project, we have the color organ, and when I turn on the slide switch, the LED cycles through all of its colors on its own. I am not pushing any buttons or reconnecting any wires. It does it all by itself. That is because an oscillator works on its own. The color organ is controlling itself with the wiring setup that I have. And as you can see, I have the fiber optic tree to make it look more spectacular. 34 is Dance to the Music. I connected my iPod to the circuit and I'm going to play some music on it. Right now the song I'm going to play is has a pretty hard beat to it, Danger Zone. Look how quickly the LED on the color organ changes colors. It's dancing in sync to the music. And they want you to compare fast and slow songs as well as different volume levels. When I turn down the volume, the LED stops changing between colors because it cannot hear the music. It's like the LED hears the music and responds according to its volume level 
and its beat as well. Now I'm going to slowly turn the volume up and now it's on a very low volume and it is it's changing colors now but not as fast as it is when it is at full volume. Now I'm going to switch to a slower song The colors are still changing pretty fast, but this song has a slower beat. Turn the volume down and the LED remains one color. You can also change the volume using the RV right here. I think moving it toward you makes the sound louder. because this circuit is very simple it's not going to be as loud as in other music players like if you're wearing headphones the sound would be much louder than it is with this circuit thirty five is super dance to the music the principle of this project is very similar to the previous one but as you can see this circuit looks more complicated and it is going to be louder and more sensitive. We're going to turn on the slide switch. I put the fiber optic tray on the color organ LED instead of the tower attachment. But now I'm going to put some music on. I'm going to put on this classic Prince song. Then I will adjust the RV resistor and move the lever very slowly. You may not hear anything, but on this project, there's a very narrow range where you can hear the sound clearly. It's recommended that you keep the volume on your music device halfway, but then you can slowly increase it all the way. You may have to move the RV lever for the best sound quality. The LED is, once again, switching colors in accordance to the beat and volume of the music. Both of these projects amplify the music so that it can be heard through the speaker. Project 36 is Super Dance to the Music. We are going to use the same circuit as in Project 35, but we will remove the C4 capacitor, and it is called Super Dance to the Music 2. Turn on the volume. I left the RV setting the way it was in the previous project. I'm using the same song as well. Once again, there's a... There's a, let, there's a narrow range in which the sound is clear, and even though it won't be as loud as in the previous project, it's less distorted. It'll be a better quality audio. 37 is follow the music. I hooked up a music device, and I'm going to turn on the slide switch. I'm not putting any, I'm not going to put any attachment over the color organ LED, but you can see that it's blinking rapidly. It's rapidly switching colors. And I am going to play music and the color organ will dance and sync with it. I have a song with a slow beat playing right now. When the volume is all the way down, the color organ is just rapidly switching colors, like an oscillator. Now as I increase the volume, the switching of the color LED increases considerably. The sound quality is very poor on this circuit. 38 is color organ with headphones. For this project, we are going to insert a pair of headphones into this jack on the color organ. 
the right jack is where the cable for music device goes. And the cable would go into your music device where you would insert the headphones there. Now I am going to say how good the sound quality is when I turn on the slide switch and play music. The sound quality is amazing compared to when you use the speaker. The LED on the color organ changes colors at the same rate according to the beat and volume of the music. You probably recognize this song. Can you guess what it is? Note that the output signal to headphones is mono, so you're not going to hear stereo effects for this circuit. 39 is adjustable light dance. We're going to turn on the slide switch, and the LED on the color organ will switch in according to the rate at which the strobe integrated circuit is set at. We'll also hear a high-pitched sound on the RV's highest setting. Let's slowly move the lever down, and the rate at which the color organ changes colors slows as the sound becomes more low-pitched. On the lowest setting, the color organ is still changing colors, but very, very slowly. Now I'm going to increase the rate at which the color organ changes color and the volume of the sound. Now it's louder and more high-pitched. 